Malika's second question, what's the ruling on organ donations? Well, first of all, blood donation, there's no problem in that. It is prohibited to sell blood, but to donate it, whether to Muslims or non-Muslims, as long as they're not combatant. You do not go to an, a, 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 a kafir or a non-Muslim army and you do not donate blood to them. They're enemies and they're combatant uh, uh, against Islam. So you don't do this. Now, when it comes to organ donations, while alive, if donating this organ does not harm me and it can reproduce itself, I think liver, if, if you donate part of it, it reproduces itself and there's no harm on your uh, uh, medical condition. If you donate um, a kidney, for example, and you have two or three of them and it would not affect you, uh, the vast majority of scholars say that this is okay. Now, talking about donation after death, the, the, the scholars have uh, uh, disputed upon this. Um, a great portion of them say that this is permissible. I personally say that or believe that the scholars who said it is prohibited are correct. Why? Because the corpse of a Muslim deceased has its honor and dignity and we must not violate this for donation. So yeah, but there are people who will die. They will eventually die. May Allah have mercy on them. But I would not allow anyone to cut me open after my death to take my uh, uh, um, kidneys or, or liver or heart for other people because this goes against the teachings of Islam where the Prophet says Islam, the breaking of a deceased or a corpse bone is like breaking it when he's alive. So it has its sanctuary, it has its sacredness and it must not be violated and Allah knows best. 